Hi, I'm going to show you a quick demonstration of the new localization module present in the Carto SDK. For that purpose, I'm going to use the Carto Windows uh, application program that comes when we install Carto. Go in the Start menu, All Programs, Carto SDK, Carto. This is the application program we use to demonstrate Carto. That application do is going to read XML file, log file co collected using real robot and going to process it as fast as it can to show you either the SLAM system, the localization, the path planning, or even the exploration. So we preloaded that application with couple maps we collected there. So if you go to the file menu, go to Intel, this is the Intel data log from the Open SLAM project. Since we preloaded that map, the map is already pre-computed and is displayed here as the same system you can see here. The card has also loaded all the scan that was present in that file. There is about 895 scan, laser scan in that data file. What we're going to do is now we're going to do use those data files and that pre-computed map to have the robot localized just by using the odometry and the laser scan. So go to test localization. In that case, the robot is moving along by correcting its position using a Monte Carlo localization system. The green arrow, the green path is actually the Monte Carlo path. The red path is the odometry path. The robot moves extremely fast in that demonstration because the processor on that machine is quite fast and it can process the 800 scan immediately. On average, an update on the Monte Carlo localization takes less than 10 milliseconds. What's also interesting is we can do the localization with complete map like here or even with partial map. I'm going to show you that. Let's do a new test. File, new, then file open and in that case I'm going to use a data collected by one over here at SRI. When we load that we have 819 scan. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to do a mapping, test mapping. 5 cm per pixel for the resolution is fine. In that case the robot is moving back and forth in that in that environment. I'm going to stop that test voluntarily and then use the same data log from the beginning to localize in that portion map. Go to All you have to do is go test localize. And then by using the same system, this is how the system works now and keep the robot localized just by using the Monte Carlo localization. Stop the test at any time. This is a quick view of what Carto can do in terms of localization with the data. You've seen that it's possible to localize in a complete map or it's also possible to localize just by using a partial map. Thank you.